Bumanest, I'm Jay Kazdar, Kitbab Vaz, Bumanest, Goa, UK, Association of Diox, Flavibab Gracious, Bumanest, Anga Dutre Fudari, Machir, Anga Domile, Mogar, Goinkar, Bando and Buenando. Pratik or Sak, I mean Vegre Vegre Deshani, EMJ Vishwa Gomant Samilan Kurta, Global Goans Convention. अन्य अन्यथा ये सुंदर शारण लंदन के शारण कितने बार निश्चित पड़े हैं हम जो शार्ट पड़े हैं तो लंदन जे ताड़ी मारा था कि गोएं गोएं को शिंदिस्ता आता हम पड़े गोएं को शिंदिस्ता हम पूर्वी यानी शाबाश की नहीं था हम जो फ्लाविओ वाब ग्रेशियस अंतांचे सांगाती मार्कटन तो जल गयी कि आमका रिपोर्ट आने इन दिवसों ये सम्मेलन जो अन्य और रिपोर्ट आने शापते ले हम जो ऑफिस आंट आने शापून फगलंग पावते ले पावित ले आने पोर्गोटे इतले फ्रेंड्स इट्स अ प्लेजर एंड इट्स अ प्रिविलेज फॉर मी टू बी हियर इन दिस ब्यूटीफुल सिटी ऑफ लंदन वेल इट लुक्स बेटर देन गोवा रियली एट दिस � and I'm so happy to be here at this Global Goans Convention, the first time we have it in London. The purpose of the convention that we have every year is to bring Goans together to maintain in them the sense of identity. Identity is important for everybody. Every human being must have a sense of identity, of cultural identity that makes you, that makes us better people, whether they are gone, whether they are British, whether they are of any other culture or any other nationality. So that's why we have this Global Goans Convention. We had it first in Goa, then we moved on to Portugal, where we have had Goans now for more than a century. One of the Goans there became Prime Minister. Who knows, sir? We may have a Prime Minister, Goan Prime Minister here in, in England. What do you say, sir? Yay! Yay! <laughs> Well, but then we have this tradition there in Portugal. We move from Portugal to Canada, from Canada to where lots and lots, increasing number of Goans go nowadays. That is the Gulf countries, that is Oman and Kuwait. And then we are here in London. It has been a great pleasure, sir. Ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, my friends. Goinkar, Bando and Boinando. You must have been here at that time. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Edward Falero, Flavio Gracious, members of the committee, friends. It is a huge honor and privilege for me, Maria, and Angeli to be here with you on this very special occasion. Can I start by saying to you, Edward Falero, you are a true legend as far as the Goan community is concerned all over the world and the terrific work that you do as the Commissioner for NRIs in Goa has been properly recognized in the way in which Goans all over the world adore it when you come and visit them and hope that you will come more often. You have done so much in order to remind us of the importance of the Goan identity. This convention is very important to me because actually the first time I ever saw my wife Maria was at a Goan convention. She was sitting in the audience but now she's made it up onto the stage. And she was trying to entice me when I met her in Goa to visit the Sol Patel store. But it succeeded, and we love to come to this convention wherever it is, and I want to pay tribute to Flavio Gracious and his marvelous team of volunteers who have made this into such a terrific festival. And just looking around, and we wandered around to look at all the stalls, people have come from all over the world to be here. There are even people from Leicester. Is there anyone here from Leicester? Wonderful, because I need a lift home, so that's very helpful. But they've really come from everywhere, and I think it shows how special we are as a community, that we can gather together and be able to celebrate our heritage. 
That is why I brought Anjali here today, because I think it is really important that our children understand there is more to Goa than the beaches and the sunshine. That is a, it is a cultural identity which we need to preserve. And this is best done with the work of the community here, Flavio and all his colleagues. So you are standing there in the hot Goan sun, as Eduardo has said. I have invited him to the House of Commons for lunch tomorrow. Unfortunately, you know how very badly members of parliament are paid. So I can't invite all of you as well. But as I said to my, as I said to my friend Tony Lewis, I hope that you will have a function in Parliament very soon. Um, perhaps not all 6,000 people, but certainly enough of you to come along and celebrate our culture with some real go and music. So thank you very much for listening. Thank you for coming. Those of you who've come from all parts of the world, I met someone from California sitting over there. He'd, he'd flown over from California. Somebody else from, uh, I think, the United States who was making Eduardo work. He had a property dispute in Goa, so he was giving the case to Eduardo. So anyone with any property disputes, please see the commissioner before he goes. He's very happy to help. But thank you for coming, and I look forward, Maria, Angeli, and I look forward to seeing you wherever this convention is next year. Thank you very much. Mr. Mr. Ferrero, Keith Vaz, and Francisco Martin, Mr. Mrs. Ferrero, sorry, and Mr. and Mrs. Keith Vaz. Vice Admiral John De Silva, our honored guests from overseas, ladies and gentlemen. It's been a tremendous hard work, but seeing you all here makes it all very satisfying.